The Kolam Ai ABC waterfront was created by converting a 250 meter stretch of Kalang River between Bendemeer Road and Kolam Ai Pedestrian Bridge into a beautiful space. It was completed in 2008. ABC Waterfront is a partnership between BUB and N Park. Are the improvements to be made here? Yes, what are they? Well, I'd like to see more youths like you here. So far, I've seen more families and older folks here. It would be great if we can entice the younger generation to spend more time here. With groups like that, it is clear that PUB and N Parks have achieved their aim of developing most of this beyond their functional use, where recreational and communal bonding activities take place. Through initiatives like this, the cohesiveness of the society will be strengthened. I'm Justin signing off.
Hi, my name is Justin and I'm from Chongqing Primary School. I'm here at the Kulao Aya ABC Siri, okay, Siri, okay, here, come, we, 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 try, we try and get into the point. Hey, don't move. Alright. My name is Hi. Yes. Of course. Hi, my name is Justin. And I'm from Chongqing Primary School. I'm here at the Kolam Ayer ABC Waterfront. The Kolam Ayer ABC Waterfront is a partnership between PU, PUB and, and PAX. This waterfront. Wait, one more time. The Kolam Ayer. The Kolam Ayer. The Kolam Ayer. ABC Waterfront is a partnership between PUB and N PAX. This waterfront project has involved many in the community. The community has taken ownership of this ABC site. Kayak Kankis, in particular, has been a regular user of this site. Kayak Kankis is a kayaking as well as outdoor group. The group conducts regular kayaking sessions here at Kolam Ayo. I have me, I have with me, Mr. Leon Lee, one of the members of this group. How are you today, Mr. Lee? I'm fine, yourself? I'm fine, thank you. Mr. Lee, how long have you been kayaking? Um, about three to four years. Before your group started kayaking here, where have you been kayaking? Well, our group was kayaking in the open sea uh, when we first started. Uh, that was difficult for many of us who were beginners. We had to deal with the sea current and the tide. So when did you decide to start kayaking here? Well, our group made up immediately after PUB announced that it will allow water activities. Our group made up immediately after PUB announced that it would allow water sport activities to take place at the reservoirs. We listed the possible sites and took a vote. Since many of us live around this area, Kolamai won the vote. Okay, so has the experience been better? Oh, definitely. The scenery is also beautiful. As you can see, we get to see a lot of greeneries. It is also nice to have children and adults waving to you as you kayak. But unfortunately, it's raining today, so I don't think you can see much. Well, personally, I feel more connected when I kayak. Oh, you can see. <laughs> yeah, I do again, okay? Alright, so just ask. Okay, so what's the experience? Okay, so I have the experience. Wait, one more. Okay, so I have the experience. Oh, definitely. The scenery here is also beautiful. We get to see a lot of greeneries. It is also nice to have children and adults waving to you as you kayak. Personally, I feel more connected when I kayak here. In the open sea, you are alone with your thoughts. Mr. B, now that you have been part of the community for quite a bit, are there improvements to be made here? Yes, what are they? Well, i like to see more youths like you here. So far, I've seen more families and older folks here. It would be great if we can entice the younger generation to spend more time here. They bring with them a certain energy to the place. Perhaps more performances at open areas, open air screening of movies for families and things like that. Okay, thank you Mr. Lee for your time. I hope to see you around. Besides the kayak hockeys, there are other activities that take place around the area. There are groups that conduct more young societies, gardening, art performances, and more for the community. With groups like that, it's clear that PUB and NPARCs have achieved their aims of developing water bodies beyond their functional use with where recreational and communal bonding activities take place. Cut. Do again with groups like? 